Buongiorno. <laughs> oh, the app saying it's three degrees today. It does feel a bit warmer because it's been like minus three, minus four. So, yeah, in the parking lot again, as you can see. Only reason for that is it's been snowing quite a bit in other places. So, come on in. Yeah, I thought, should it snow to the point where I'm going to get stuck for a day or two, then at least I'm localish to my kids. I've got Tesco's just up the road, I've got a chemist, I've got all the amenities here. So, yeah, I just thought it'd be, just makes sense to be local. So I'm still, I can still do shopping and everything. I can still see the kids and whatever. So, yeah. So it's the parking lot until this weather picks up and there's no threat of snow. Yeah. Oh yeah, look what I've got in my van. You won't believe it. Come on, I'll show you. Come on, I'll show you. Come on. Oh, what is that I hear you say, Tom? Alright uh, guys, uh, I'm in my mother's at the moment, uh, I'm using her uh, house as a postal address and uh, yeah, I've just had a parcel. I'm trying to do it all in one go. Oh yes! <laughs> oh my god! Right, let's get this out. But yeah, this is what they sent me, guys. It's the R1500 with dual phone charging on the top. Don't even know you. Is it a long press? Yeah. 73%. That's pretty good. Wow, two USB ports, two U USB C ports, 100 watts, 100 watts each charging. And, uh, <laughs> oh my god, four plug sockets. Wow using the, the plug in my mum's house at the moment, but this is on 73%. Five minutes ago, it's on 98 now. I don't know what them figures are, but I think I'm assuming the 246 is the watts going into the power station. Like the watts out is zero because I have not put anything on it. Not sure what the 50 hertz is, but the time, like three minutes, I'm taking that's three minutes left before it's 100%. Yeah, I can't wait to get that in the van. Wow. They're sending me a solar panels as well, so... I thought they might have all come together, but yeah. It'll probably be tomorrow now or something. I'll probably get an email later saying that they're on their way. But, oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. This is the, uh, <clears throat> the All Powers R1500. And uh, yeah, you can see I have been using it. I've been using it loads, to be honest. <clears throat> With phones on here, I got dual phone uh, wireless phone charging on the top, and uh, all my other little 12 volt devices as well. And it's still on 63%, so that's fantastic. And yeah, you just press these. That's to use the uh, the USBs, the DC out, and then you got a 12 volt here, which is just a, a regular like cigarette lighter type, and then this one operates the four plug sockets, so it's like an inverter, and uh, yeah, it's been an absolute game changer for me 
And not only did they send me the actual power station itself, but they also sent me this 200 watt solar panel. But yeah, as you can see outside, the cloud coverage is thick. It looks like it is going to snow, so the cloud is, th yeah, it's really thick. So it does work. So, but it, I'm not going to get anything to put into that power station. So, yeah. What I'm having to do at the moment is charge it in friends' houses or my mum's house. Or, yeah, just doing it that way. Yeah, that's some specifications for the solar panel. For the portable power station, you get this little pack. And inside it, you get your manual in all different types of language so you can always read it and then you get a list of little uh, finders on Facebook with the scan code that's for your warranty this is just the general information about the ports With the batteries being lithium iron phosphate, phosphate, I can never, I'm going to struggle with that. You know what I mean? It means that the, the unit does not get as hot. They don't run as hot and it stays cooler. But it also means you can run this unit to zero, should you have to. I haven't done that as yet, so... Um, I've had this now a good couple of weeks, you know, really, and I've, yeah, I think I've only got it down to like 35% was the, the first time I charged it, so, and it's a fast charge, oh my god, yeah, I think it was half an hour, 45 minutes, and it was fully charged, so, yeah, absolutely amazing on that. I do have my Cartier window clean suction so see everything's on zero there now so we'll see what it pulls now when I charge do I need to turn I'll tell you what I'll just turn that off for a minute turn that off I'll put it back on yeah I just did a click see the green light flashing so it's charging but it's not even taking any power at the battery now I've let it run now about a minute and if you can see these, they're still on zero. I got an electric razor there as well, so I'm gonna plug that in as well. That's in. I don't know if you can see that, the lights on that, but they're flashing. And it's still on zero. It's gone down from 63 to 61. Yeah, that's weird. Yeah, when I put my phone on top of here, that output went to 10. So it did go, but obviously I'm using my phone as a camera. So yeah, I couldn't put it on charge and film it. So, <laughs> so yeah. You'd have to take my word on that, but it did go to 10 watts going out. So, yeah. 
and it is Bluetooth uh, capable as well so I've got the app on my phone the all powers app and uh, you have to put the uh, I'll show you now you have to long press there's nothing on the screen there now you have to long press that one and then you got the Bluetooth signals there and then you go on your app you press which power unit you've got and then it it connects automatically and that is a great feature because you can also keep an eye on the battery status status and everything else in the app you can turn stuff on and off so yeah you haven't got to bend down or if it's in the boot or yeah you just use your app and turn everything on that you want so yeah the actual unit itself I've read I've written it down because there's a lot and I will forget it so I'm looking down because I've got the paper there. It's an 18, 1,800 pure sine wave AC output with a 3,000 watt surge, which is massive. It's got a long lasting, long lasting, long lasting life pour for battery, which has more, get this, more than 3,500 cycles, more than. So yeah, that is great. It's got a max maximum 650 watt solar charging, which will charge from zero to full in two hours. So it's fast charging on that solar panel as well. It's got four ways of charging. So you've got the AC, you've got the solar, it's auto, and you've got dual AC and solar. So yeah, take note of that one. You can put connect it twice, you know, both ways, and get it charging even quicker. The top of it, it's got your, uh, your wireless phone chargers, which is a two of them, and they're 15 watts max. So, that's that's still bloody good. It's, and uh, it's got a 24-7 uninterrupted power supply. It's got smart app control with Wi-Fi, an amp, and plus it's Bluetooth connection. So, yeah, it's got a lot going on, guys. And, uh, yeah, it's absolutely fantastic. See, I've, I've been using it. I got my uh, LED lights plugged into this one, but that is only because it's got a short, short wire, and that my unit lives down there now. So but I'm going to look around for a, a female and a male uh, extending lead for USB. And then once that's the case, I'll be plugging it straight into that and I can just use it on my app to turn the lights on and off when I'm in bed and stuff. I haven't got to get out of bed. <laughs> so, yeah, I want to thank all powers for supporting the channel and sending me out this unit with the solar. They did send it free of charge. So, yeah, I want to thank them massively. Yeah, really, really thank you. And uh, yeah, so far it's a game changer for me. Yeah. So having that uh, inverter, so I can plug stuff in to charge as well. I can run power tools, should, if I've got any, which I haven't. So yeah, she was just trying to sniff my phone then, little bugger. But yeah, thank you, all powers. Yeah, it's massive. Thank you. And just to end on this one, all the descriptions, everything to do with all powers will be in the description below. So yeah, check them out guys. And if you're wondering what power to use, what company to use, this, that and the other, yeah, I'm recommending all powers because they have been fantastic. And the unit is fantastic. Yeah, absolutely made up with it. And yeah, I moved my cooler now to under the bed there, fits nicely. And uh, yeah, the unit now lives there. Let's get a coffee on, because you all know me. <laughs> Always got time for coffee. Oops. Buongiorno.
<laughs> it is good morning. Yeah, I didn't do a, a lot of filming yesterday after. Uh, got late in the day and uh, yeah, just had some stuff to do, shopping and what have you. Then I went to the bass player's house when he cooked us another meal because it's a Monday and we practice on a Monday. So thank you very much, Graham. That was lovely. And uh, band practice last night. It was about half nine when we finished. So it was 10 o'clock when I got to a, this park up. So yeah, I just chilled. Didn't really film at all. Well, I didn't film. Yeah, I want to phone the vets today for her. Nothing wrong, nothing, you know. But she's coming into season. And I've been told that there's a tablet or some sort of stuff that you can give a dog that sort of stops the bleeding, the spotting. Because, yeah, she's on the bed, she's on the... So, yeah, if I can stop that, that'd be amazing. And then I'll book her in before the next one and uh, I'll get her neutered so yeah she can she can have that so because I, I don't want pups you know where am I going to put pups in here you know for the nine weeks so yeah it's stupid isn't it and uh, irresponsible breeding so nope she can uh, she can have the operation but yeah if I can stop that bleeding that would be bloody awesome to be honest she still goes through the cycle of being in on heat but yeah it stops the stops the bleeding I'm, I'm told so I'll phone the vets see if they can uh, help me on that oh dear she's only just coming into season so yeah it's not spotting yet it's about another week and then it starts so I've got this week to sort it out And we go, yes, oh, hormones everywhere, don't they, yeah, can't be nice with a dog, can it, all that changes in the body, give me this bloody toy, I've been trying to lose that for months, <laughs> yeah, I did me shopping yesterday, mostly dog food for her, got the dog food for the month, so I haven't got to worry, yeah, Filled up with diesel, so it's full tank, brimmed. <laughs> yeah. I'm in the parking lot again, you know, where I'm always am lately, because, oh yeah. The app, the weather app saying, you know, it's going to snow, then it doesn't, it turns to rain, but then it starts snowing and then it, that turns to rain, so yeah, hopefully it'll stay off. You can bug it off, you know what I mean? Some friends of mine are in the Peak District and uh, yeah, they've had some good snow there. So yeah, safe travels, always. Yeah, that's the weather outside. It's it's not the best. It has been raining, so yeah. See, the condensation through that one. I haven't done the uh, cars yet on that window yet. <laughs> Yeah, but on that note, so the car to you, the window sucker wiper. Oh my God, yeah. Absolutely amazing. Highly recommend any van life getting one. Part-time, occasional on the weekends or full-time. Oh my God, yeah. Because when I'm wiping it, with the, even with a tea towel or the kitchen roll, it you leave that smear, you know, on your front one and your sun hits it and you're like, oh, bloody hell. That because it's it's like a polisher as well it oh yeah crystal clear and all that water goes away so yeah absolutely awesome yeah so if you haven't got one go and get one <laughs> right i'm gonna end this video now guys and uh, yeah i want to thank you all for tuning in watching my videos and uh yeah thank you so much Bloody awesome, innit? Aye, aye, bloody awesome. Right, until the next one, guys. Be good, be safe, and as always, enjoy yourselves. Take care, guys, and I'll see you soon. Bye now.